Cameron Diaz likes working out in the morning because she believes it's better for her body. Does it matter what time of day you work out? Let's ask Dr. Rascala of Performance Spine and Sports Medicine. The best time of the day for you to work out is every day. Time of day does not increase calories burned, but the source of those calories may differ. So for example, exercise first thing in the morning is typically on an empty stomach. This theoretically can cause your body to use fat stores for energy, preferentially over glycogen, which comes from carbohydrates. Carbohydrates give you energy to work out. Without glycogen stores, it's difficult to increase your intensity. Therefore, if you are working out in the morning before breakfast, it should be a less intense program so that you don't bonk. That being said, exercise is always better than no exercise. Don't ever feel that you missed your optimal time to work out and therefore skip the whole day. What does change throughout the day are your energy levels and the time to dedicate to exercise. So time of day may affect the way you feel when you exercise. But what's most important is your schedule. Some people swear by morning workouts while others can't imagine working out until the end of the day. One thing to watch out for if you are an end of the day exerciser is insomnia. When it's time to sleep, your heart rate and your body temperature should be well within the rest zones. If you are exercising or even eating late, it can sabotage your urge to sleep. If you feel this is happening, try exercising earlier in the day. And I don't mean hitting the snooze button. Working out in the morning can give you energy throughout the day, and that might be enough to combat the morning snooze. Whatever time you decide is best for you, stick with it until it's a habit. That will get you the results from your workout.